I just realized that I clap in almost every single intro that I do. But welcome back, you guys. This whole intro is more of a viewer's discretion is advised more than a hey, welcome to my channel because of what we did in this video. So what we did in this video is we skinned a snake, specifically a diamondback rock snake. Mohoven rattlesnake. Moh Mohave rattlesnake? I think this is what we have. Yep, I think this is it. This is, I think, the, the exact one. So we have what we call Mohave rattlesnake, a desert danger. The Mohave rattlesnake is a deadly pit vi viper that lives in the desert of the U.S. and Mexico. And to some But yeah, so I guess that is what we have. Um... I'm that's that's looks almost exact. If I am wrong, put tell me what what type I have in the comments because there's twenty something of them apparently. So or twelve, I think it's a twenty something. Um, so let me know. But um, to get to the disclaimer, this video does contain content that is me cutting up a rattlesnake. It is me skinning it, which means gutting it. I won't show or explain what had happened because I know some people that also grosses them out. I do say later in filming, um, I do not have any of the proper stuff to keep the skin can to keep the skin um, from probably decomposing. So I'm not really sure. I'm just kind of winging it. If it does go wrong, then I know and I'll properly. I'll probably buy stuff even now just so that I know because I would love to. Your uh, description is advised. Enjoy the video. I'm not hurting any of the meat. I'm getting right down the line. Like there's the stomach, the lining. Yeah. And there's something in him, so I'm probably gonna see like a dead animal in here. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Love you. Ah! Oh, I got the stomach. <laughs> Look. Oh yeah. It's like the intestines or something. Maybe not the stomach, but probably the intestines. All right, so if you guys don't know what I'm doing, I am cutting up a rattlesnake we just killed. Dude, this is insane. Skinning him is what I'm doing. Because I want to be able to hang him on our wall. Or if not the bar, then my wall. Oh, I'm getting all the. Yep. Got everything. I'm not like too grossed out by this. It's gross, but something like awful. I like something in here to be the worst. but it's weird oh my god dude it's interesting to me I'm not gonna go off and kill people but they look I 
chunk. I'm just cutting down to the belly like the, like, like the guy did so that the back is good and I can just have to peel it off. I guess it peels off easily. It didn't curl off or anything? No, it peels off super easy and then you just have to put tacks in it. Dry it and I dry it out. I'll have to look that up, part up too. Like, so here's like the meat part, like where the bone is, and now I'm just peeling off the skin. So I can shit. Oh, now I cut kind of it, kind of cut it in half, but that's okay. Oh, dude, this is gross. I don't know, like, what I'm gonna do with. Okay, I'm editing the video now, so here again, here is your warning. Viewer's discretion is advised. This is where it gets gory and gruesome. The, um, like how I'm gonna pour out the inside. I'm just kind of like trying to mainly get the skin off. Dude, it's just peeling off. This is where it gets gross though. <laughs> Cause I have to like, this is where it gets gross near the end. Oh! Look at that. <laughs> and in the beginning of this video, I will do a fewer discretion is advised because this is We got the rattlesnake skin. I am not a professional, but um, that was pretty simple. Um, I just, I'll put the description of the video of the video that I watched because this, look at that. This wasn't too hard, but it wasn't the easiest thing because it is gross. You have to have a very strong stomach to, to do something like this. Now, obviously, we didn't just kill the rattlesnake because we hate them. No, I these are one of my favorite snakes in the entire world since I've been like a little kid. And, um, okay, this, this part is where it gets gross. But here's all the, the meat and the, the, the stomach, the everything and I'm just gonna go throw this somewhere just threw it out and I think I have a very strong stomach because I just had dinner so I'm to like lay it out so it stays flat and it dries up all right so I just skinned him he's pretty long actually um I'm about to do fewer research because I just realized I'm not really sure what to do aftermath of skinning him. His body's over there. If you can see it, I don't know if you can, it's right where my finger is. And um, yeah, we're gonna figure out what to do with him. I'll come back and I'll show you guys what to do in the afterwards. All right, so I'm about to move this closer to the hose so that I can wash it and then I don't have like the proper alcoholic stuff to use and you know I kind of did this very amateurly so if it gets ruined it gets ruined um if it doesn't it ho hopefully it doesn't I'm gonna put it on one of those pieces of ply well not plywood but two by fours and then hopefully nail it nail it down and then hopefully uh it'll it'll stay
because we just finished that show. I liked that show. It was a it was a good show. Um, if you do get grossed out by this, um, I mean it's just the skin part, so I don't know how people would, but obviously don't watch the video. Like I said, I'll say that in the very beginning, but I say it again. Like, I mean, obviously I highly support like people with animal like rights of being like, oh yeah, like I think people who are vegan are fucking awesome, but. We have dogs, and it was right in front of our house. Like, right maybe 10 feet from our door. There's mosquitoes everywhere. Um, so obviously we're gonna, we're gonna kill it. piece of wood is. It's like almost half of that. Now, I gotta go move the body with this as well and then we'll wash it off and then we'll, we'll figure out where to put it so it doesn't get eaten and hope it just kind of stays. I don't know. I said if, if it rots, it rots and if I fail, it's fine but Hopefully it doesn't rot. But yeah, while he's over there, skin's done. Hooray. All right, so you guys get to come with me to actually see the um, insides. So from this point forward, if you do not, and I repeat, if you do not want to see the inside of a, a living creature, don't watch to this point because this will not be blurred out. So from this point forward, if you do not want to see, don't watch. Because it's going to be the inside of a rattlesnake. I'm talking heart, guts, blood, spine, skin. So here you go. Here's the insides. It's covered in grass, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, so here's, where's the heart at? This is the heart right here. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, because this is where the tail is. I'm gonna try and get this grass off of it. Oh, oh that scared me. These sticks, oh, got on my skin. All right, all these weeds. I just chucked it. I didn't like think that I would come back and have to move it, but I realized it was too close to my house. So yeah, this is, I'm trying to get it to focus. There we go. This is, and it's kind of grimy, but there's the intestines. There's, oof, stinks. Um, nice coyotes. Oh, this is like a whole, a whole nother smell. It's not even like rotting flesh. It's just, uh, it's gross. But we're going to move it over by the pond. Oh, I just stepped, I stepped in something. I'm watching for like rattlesnakes as well, so if you guys can't really see anything, I apologize. But um, yeah, walking through to the pond area where we're gonna throw this thing over. And he's a he's a decent size. Next rattlesnake that I kill, I will want to cook it. So I'm gonna order like special stuff because my dad doesn't want his barbecue stuff touching that that type of thing. So here we go. Here's where our little dried out pond is that I'm just gonna. Lay out right here. Ugh. There's flies following me, and I don't want the flies landing on my face, but there's the the top, and then you guys saw the insides right there. Yeah. There's the spine right there, and then here the ending is also spine. This is this is the spine. This is the ribs, all the way down, spine, and then get the, the clean side I guess this is kind of like the better side to look at but yeah that's it's inside of a rattlesnake for you 
Okay, so for some reason, me having an entire footage is no longer there, but I ended up washing it and um, cleaning it with soap, and we measured it, it's 33 inches, which is insane, and um, granted that is just the skin, it's not like the length of the snake, but I mean, I guess it would be like the same thing if you get right. But yes, I that is in the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Sorry that you guys didn't get to see me clean it. That was like one of my most favorite parts about it was cleaning the skin off and um, showing you guys me more thoroughly on the um, board. But it's in the garage now. Just we're just hoping that it kind of stays cool and dries out right there. We're gonna cut the wood down so that it's smaller. But um, thanks for watching, subscribe, hit the notification bell, that way you can notify when a video does go out, and I will see you guys in the next one.